All right, good afternoon, Hume 4. This is your principal, Ms. Keene, and I want to talk to you about the week of April 13th. So I know that this was scheduled to be our spring break, and I know that for many of us, it was disappointing to hear that it would not be as we were planning. Um, the governor decreed that we needed to stay in session, that all schools should stay in session, and I cannot go against that decree. Uh, nor do I think that we should, based on the current concerns regarding public health. It's important that you are staying inside and staying away um, from others at this time, social distancing, to keep you and your family safe. And that is important to the governor and it is also important to me. I hope that you can try to understand that although this is disappointing, it is in our best interest long term. You do have April 9th and 10th off. You have April 9th and 10th off. That is this Thursday and Friday, the week of the 13th. We have created a plan that I think is fair, that I think allows you to have some space to catch up on things, um, but that also gives you some simple and clear directions for how to make sure your attendance is taken and for how to make sure you really maximize your potential to get caught up and um, receive fantastic grades during this week. So please uh, follow along with me. I'm gonna share my screen with you at this time. All right, so this is the plan for you. So just go through this with me. So during the week of April 13th and 17th, you have school. We have worked to structure this to be as simple as possible. Like I said, with ample opportunity for you to catch up on process and product assignments. Every day will be a focus on a different content area with only those teachers working on that day. Your attendance will be tracked via your attendance in one of three morning workshops. You get to choose which one you attend and by your completion of a short assignment on each day. Your create grade will come from your completion of a short assignment each day. You will not have progress monitoring due. You will not receive calls from your ensemble facilitators for attendance during this week. So if you do not attend a workshop or if you do not complete the short assignment for the day, you will be marked absent. Please make sure this does not happen. Workshop times are as follows. There'll be one at nine, 10, and 11. You can attend any which one you want. You only need to attend one. This will count as your attendance and your teachers will review the assignment for the day. Again, this will be a short, simple, hopefully fun, creative assignment for you. Here's the workshop schedule just to give you a sense of what I'm talking about. So Monday, the teachers that will be Holding workshops will be your arts teachers, your physical education teachers, and your Spanish teacher. Every day we will have members of SST and a member of operations also supporting as needed. Tuesday, as you can see, will be math. And once we receive the links from your teachers, this document will be shared with you. And you can just click on the links. See, this is Miss Mullings. Mr. Dabrowski's Zoom link. And this is the link for any of the three workshops. All right, so anytime it works for you, between 9 and 11.45, you can hop into a Zoom meeting, one of three, to get your attendance credit. Wednesday will be ELA, Thursday science, Friday history. If you need someone to talk to uh, during the week of April 13th, please reach out to the teachers and staff available this day. When we're done with this documents, we'll populate it with their email addresses so you don't have to search for those if you're needing to reach out for someone uh, for some support. Other than that, enjoy your break. Um, and, you know, one thing I just want to say again to you is that if you are able to have some more mental space and energy to do so, please consider making a short video that documents uh, what life is like for you, what school is like for you at this time, what it's like creating art during this time. 
and you can send those videos to me. I would love to be able to post them to our blog channel, our COVID-19 blog channel um, that is now live. So yeah, again, short videos, short stories, funny stories, inspirational stories, videos of you making art, um, anything and everything um, that may be coming up that we can share as a way of documenting our experiences during this time. So please rewatch this video if it would be helpful. This is an explanation of what you should expect the week the 13th. More information will be coming. You will be shared on a document that will have all the links that you need. And your teachers will be going over this explicitly on Wednesday during workshop hours. Thank you for listening. Okay, reach out if you need any help. I'm here.